Well, the B2 offers us that flexible option in a world where our enemies are continu continually uh, developing new and better air defense systems. And with those systems, it basically keeps our older uh, systems and more legacy aircraft at bay. We still need that ability to fly in and hold their targets of value at risk in a highly denied area. And that's what the B-2 provides with its low observability capabilities. As if being the world's only stealth bomber wasn't unique enough, fewer than a thousand airmen have ever flown in one. Everybody that gets to fly in the B-2 is provided a spirit number uh, via Northrop Grumman. So from the very first pilot uh, to our later guys that came after me, you have a number saying, hey, in my case, I was the 602nd person to fly in the B-2. So it just kind of puts in perspective how few people total over the lifespan of this aircraft who've actually gotten to fly the aircraft.